Then Moses and the children of Israel sang this song to the Lord and spoke this, saying, I will sing to the Lord, for he has triumphed gloriously. The horse and its rider he has thrown into the sea. The Lord is my strength and my song, and he has become my salvation. He is my God and I will praise him, my father's God, and I will exalt him. The Lord is a man of war, the Lord is his name. Exodus 15 semicolon 1 3. Good day to you, my father, my God, who you are, so fully, so well. You are my father, like no other. You are my God, my salvation, my hope and fullness. I come today to just worship you, who you are to me and to every one of your children. You are matchless, marvelous and too wonderful for mere words. May I bless you this morning with my heart song too. In Jesus' holy name I come. Amen. Lord, you know that this morning I just wanted to say, You are my God. You are my all in all, my everything. You are my Savior, my Keeper, my loving, compassionate Father. You love me with all your heart. You deserve my love in return with all my heart too. Nothing less will do. Why should I give you the very crumbs of my life, my day, when you have given me your very best all my life? I am so sorry that I am guilty of giving you my leftovers too many times. Or sometimes giving you too little of myself. When you Lord Jesus held back nothing of yourself that I might have eternal life and holiness in and by you. It is shameful to think that I am guilty of less than my best for you and the kingdom of my Father. Father. You know that this morning I wanted to find scriptures that say, exclaim that you are our God, my God, our Father and I was able to find this in Exodus, Moses and your people singing a song of worship and glory to you for their saving from Pharaoh and his army. You provided a miracle, an escape bar none. You were so amazing. I still remember the movie The Ten Commandments, and that movie, I am sure I was not to be compared with how and what you did for them, but it amazed me even as close as man tried to picture it. Your children, I am sure, were totally in awe of what they saw and walking across the bottom of the sea on totally dry ground. What that must have been like, from extreme fear one moment and then your salvation in a almighty, all-powerful deliverance so never seen or known. You were mind-blowing I am sure. I praise you for your loving kindness and mercy, and the fact that you made your presence and power fully known to them. Wow! But I wanted to see and feel in others' words and expressions today of what I am feeling this morning of just who you are to me. You are my very loving father for sure. I am thankful that here I had a loving daddy that helps me to see you as a loving father to me. Lord! Many do not have loving father figure to see and know, taste what you may be like. Thank you, Lord God, that you gave me one. He was so sweet and good and he helped me in this life and I am so grateful Father God for him. Thank you. But you are more loving than him to me and more patient and long-suffering with me and my shortcomings. You have blessed me coming and going. I am richly and abundantly cared for. I really do lack no good thing. Father God, you are for sure my strength and my life song. I know you are my everyday strength. I know you provide me with all I need to do what I need to do. I know my very life and breathe are in your hands. You really do direct my footsteps, my life, my all in all is in your powerful hands. My health is in your hands though I have something to do with it too in how I care for this body of mine. What I eat, sleep, rest, work are all my choices to make. But my life, my days are in your hands. You give me my life and my well-being, they are gifts from you to steward as I should. Please help me Lord, to do a better job with my physical health than I have, I do need your spirit's help. Father. I really would like to also praise you for my Christian heritage in my daddy, my daddy's mother, and the mortal upbringing I had. I know you planned and purposed it all. Thank you. Thank you for working in my heart as a little girl, as an adolescent, and finally as a woman. 
You have always been working in my life even from my conception. Thank you Lord God. You have been so good to me. More than good. Wonderful. Praise you Lord my God. You are my God, my Holy Father. I close this prayer this morning so grateful, so full of adoration for your goodness to me. In the marvelous name of Jesus Christ, I come, thank you Lord, Amen.